We are quickly approaching the one year mark since Hurricane Ida ripped apart homes, businesses and schools all across southeast Louisiana. But now students are returning to their campuses. Erica Ferrando visited South Terrebonne Parish High to find out how they're recovering. School is back this week for South Terrebonne High School students, but their school building is still damaged from Hurricane Ida. So they will now have class in these new modular buildings. Math in this hall, science in the next hall. South Terrebonne High students will stroll this boardwalk from class to class on the first day of school Tuesday. We have two labs um, and each science teacher has their own classroom as well. Madge Gotro is the school's new principal. Enrollment's normally about a thousand, but after the storm we did have some students displaced. 830 students or so will return to campus for the first time. It's a big relief for everybody. After being displaced, as Rhett LeCompte recalls his daughter learning from another Another school 30 minutes away last school year after Ida. She went to school at 1230 uh, at HL Bourgeois, so uh, they did a platoon schedule. Our students and co-workers went through a huge trauma um, and some of them are still dealing with those traumas. So we have to make sure that we, we remember that half the people you talk to couldn't even live in their house and everybody had damage. Katie Lede has taught at South Terrebonne High for 12 years. Everybody is just so buzzing with excitement. I love the new classrooms. The modular buildings are beautiful. She says recovery is still ongoing for her community, but being back on campus is a huge sign of progress. You get to bring the gators back to the swamp, and that's a big deal. These temporary modular buildings are leased and will be removed when the students can return to the main building. We had to borrow a some tables from neighboring schools. But until then, it's a place students will learn back home on campus. This is very nice. It smells like it smells like Home Depot in here. You know, it's, it's all brand new. You would definitely never know this was a modular building when you're sitting in here. We're excited for Friday night football games back here in the swamp. And the students will have class in these modular buildings until their school is fixed, which could be about three years. In Terrebonne Parish, Erica Ferrando, Eyewitness News. Welcome back, Gators. The superintendent in Terrebonne Parish has said repairs could cost upwards to $20 million. FEMA, by the way, is expected to take on much of the financial costs in both Terrebonne and Lafourche parishes.